A huge crowd inside the hive for a school day game on Thursday morning. The Hamilton Kilty Bees hosting students from four nearby schools. The Bees facing the Fort Erie Meteors who hit the ice in third place in the standings. Opening period, it's a terrific defensive play from Matthew Dwart. He dives and takes away his scoring chance. Dynamite from Dwart, no score after the first. Second period, the Bees open the scoring on this play. Matt Downey sends it over to Nathan O'Meary and he rips it in. In. That's a power play goal for O'Meary. He gives Hamilton a 1-0 lead. Back come the Meteors a few minutes later. Robert Schmidt is on the near side. He's got space and he's got a goal. That's his fifth of the season. We are tied at one. Later, here come the Bees. This is Dawson McKinney leading a two-on-one. But how about Rylan Masterson? He pokes it away and clears the zone. We are tied at one after 40 minutes. Let's move to the third. Hamilton with pressure. Zach Ladd lets it go. Matthew Dwart with a tip in front. That's his first goal since returning to the Kilty Bees. Dwart giving Hamilton the lead. They are up 2-1. Fort Erie looking to answer. The puck is loose in the middle. David Agaroff with a big stop on Ryland Masterson. He turns it away, keeping it a one-goal game. And in the final minute, here is the dagger. It's Dawson McKinney scoring into the empty net. McKinney recording his 14th goal of the season. And it's a Kilty Bees victory. They beat the Meteors by a final score of 3-1. Here is Matthew Duart talking about the energy in the building for the Bees' first ever school day game. That was probably one of the best atmospheres in a game I've seen at any level and, and, and we just got so fired up from the crowd. Like that was like one of the most unique games I've ever seen because it didn't feel like we were tired on the bench like once. Like we were just getting all the energy from the fans and, and it was really nice for those schools to get such a uh, nice community involvement and, and you know it's something we want out of this, this organization is to get more schools out and, and bump up the attendance and, and us get involved in the community as well is something we look for. It was uh, huge, it was great, uh, nice DDD pass from the point. Dewey's going to the net hard, gets a bounce off him, and it was huge. Like you said, the Sally was a bit questionable, but uh, he, he was just happy to get his first goal back as a Kilty, so uh, it was huge for him. Why was the Sally questionable in your mind, Justin? Uh, I think I saw three different ones out of him, so uh, might have to tell him something about that, but I'm sure he'll watch it back in the video and laugh at it himself. It was a real fun experience getting the community out. Uh, we went to the schools, got to know the kids a bit yesterday, spent some time with them, so it was great to have them out cheering for the boys, and uh, yeah, going into the holidays with a big win after a tough loss last weekend, so that's huge. Got a bit more morale boost going into this break. For more highlights, visit our website, 519sportsonline.ca. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.